Hi friends, welcome to Excel Festive. In this video, we are going to see how to use the conditional formatting highlight cells rules. Okay, see here based on the different different uh, rules, we can able to highlight the data, the cells value based on the rules, the cells value can be highlighted. Okay, see here I have given a table and here we are going to see how to use the highlight cells rules in the conditional formatting. Uh, conditional formatting can be seen in the under the home tab see here the option is the conditional formatting and here the highlight cells rules is uh, so there are different different uh, rules are there here okay this is what we are going to see in this video now the table has been given okay and the right side i have given what are the uh, uh, rules are there in that highlight cells rules before we are going to see that one the data which we need to highlight i am just selecting only that data okay now under the home tab conditional formatting i am selecting and then the highlight cells rules the first one is greater than okay i am selecting that one greater than and here the top of uh, uh, pop up dialog box is open here automatically one number is uh, uh, coming but you have to select this cell okay the greater than cell now i have selected that cell and the cells uh, references came here now at the right side see here we can able to highlight the cells based on our wish okay the colors see already some of the random colors is given and if you don't like that one you wanted to select by your own last there is an option custom format here you can go and you can select the based on your wish fill see here the border is there font you can change and the number also you can change see the greater than i have selected the blue color okay now the blue color is selected and here i am going to press okay now once i press okay see here the greater than option is here i will select that cells and whatever the number i am given here see for example i have given 80 see greater than 80 whatever the number is there, that will be uh, colored as a blue color see here so if you wanted to change uh, greater than this uh, value you can change here based on that condition the cells will be highlighted i have given 90 and see only one uh, cell is showing the value as 92 okay so this is very simple using the conditional formatting Next, I am going to select again this full data and again I am going to the conditional formatting to find the uh, second one, the less than. See here, I am going to select the less than. Same like before, we are going to select the cells here, the less than cell I am selecting. Now, again, at the right side, you can select whatever the color you wanted to highlight for the less than value. Now, I am again going to the custom format. Now, here in this dialog box, you can select whatever the color you want. Based on your uh, expectation, you can select the colors. There are so many colors are there. Now I have selected this one and giving OK. Once I give OK, <coughs> see here the in the less than value, whatever the value we are giving less than that will be highlighted in that color. Okay. Now I am just randomly giving this number. Okay. Once I give 60, see less than 60, whatever the number is there, that will be highlighted as per our selection see here i have changed here 50 and the cells also is changed now i can i am going to edit here see now here 61 is there i have given 50 less than is the color should to be changed now here already default 61 is there now i am going to change the number see less than 50 i entered i entered 40 automatically the color will be changed okay see next one i am going to enter here more than 80 see the greater than value what the rules i have given that will be uh, updated here with the blue color cells okay friends now we are going to see the next uh, one again going to the conditional uh, formatting highlight cells and between is same like the previous one greater than and less than you can easily do and now i am going to select the equal to okay now equal to again i am going to select the <coughs> before that sorry before that we need to select the full cells where we are going to find the uh, where, where we are going to apply the rules so I have selected and then I am going again to select the equal to then selecting the cell here okay cell and then whatever the color you want to make changes that you can select <coughs> again I am going to the custom format and here I am going to select one color random color whatever you want you can select I am just going to select uh, yellow color okay fine let's select the yellow color okay I have selected yellow color and I am going to press the 
OK button. So here whatever the value we are giving that will be uh, matching which cell is matching that color that cell color will be changed to yellow color. See only 180 is there so it is changed to a yellow color that cell. Now again I am going to select the another uh, cell I am going to change to 80 see based on the rules it is if the cell is having 80 then it should be uh, the filled with yellow color ok. So, it is changed now we are going to see the text. <coughs> So, we are going to see now the text sorry I think I have we have to select the cells before going to this one I will just close this one ok just before we have to select the cells and then only we should go for the conditional formatting see now I am selecting the brand column now I am going to the highlight cells and then select uh, text contains text that contains ok now I am see here the Samsung is coming the first one is automatically coming whatever you want you can edit there. Now I am pressing ok once I press ok wherever the Samsung is there that will be highlighted as red uh, uh, light red ok see red color it is highlighted. Now next one we are going to see the date range ok see before that we have to select the cells where the cells to be highlighted now I am selecting the date cells all that column is selected now I am going again to the conditional formatting and selecting the a data occurring ok. This one this option I have selected see here there are many options are there now here I am going to select whatever you want you can select I am going to select the next month. So, whatever the next month is there that will be highlighted and what color it should be highlighted we can define here see at the right side I am just giving the yellow color ok just press ok see the next month now the currently the April 2023 is running I have select the next month. So, May 2023 whatever the dates are there that will be selected in in the uh, yellow color which we have selected previously ok. Now, we are going to see the next one the duplicate values how to highlight the duplicate values based on the rules. So, now we are selecting the cells where we have to highlight the duplicate cells. So, just I am highlighting here selected and then going to the conditional formatting and selecting the duplicate values. Once I press this one see the duplicate values will be highlighted light red cells. Now, I want to change the duplicate values to be in which color I am going to select different color ok. Now, I have I am going to give the green field. So, I have selected the green one and press ok. Once you press ok, so whatever the duplicate value is there that will be highlighted as green color see like the Nokia is highlighted with green color how we have selected based on that the uh, cell is changed. See now I am changing the cell Nokia I have entered. So, this is automatically the duplicate value. So, the color is changed to green color. If I enter Samsung because the Samsung is coming because why it is coming? It is coming as a duplicate. So, uh, whatever the cell is having the duplicate values that will be highlighted with the green color ok friends. This is how you have to do the conditional formatting highlight cells rules which is very easy. I hope you guys are enjoying this, this video and if you have not uh, subscribed my channel please subscribe to get the updated excel related videos. Thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next wonderful video.